we're at a, we're with Heather here at a country restaurant. And, uh, Max Country Kitchen, actually, in Hollywood, Georgia. Yeah, and uh, is this where we make all the movies in Hollywood? <laughs> actually, uh, yes. We uh, we had one done at the Hollywood Diner up the road, and okay. uh, that was Grilling Bobby Flay or something. Okay. And then we also had Deliverance about 20 minutes up the road. Yeah. Falls. And then Black Dog was... About 20 minutes east of here. So we're becoming quite the center of <laughs> entertainment industry. Correct. Uh, Hollywood. And uh, what kind of meals do you serve here? Uh, mostly what we consider southern food. Fried chicken, uh, meatloaf, uh, mashed potatoes, English peas, cream corn, uh, cabbage casserole. Well, do you, biscuits, cornbread rolls. Do you have grits? And, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, we have yeah. grits. Definitely have grits. Um, if you come and eat grits, yeah. do not put... And gra gravy? <laughs> you have gravy? Oh, yeah. yeah. Gravy. Yeah. Biscuits. He biscuits that his, are flour biscuits. Not he not. had his first, <laughs> first grits yesterday, I think, in the breakfast over in, uh, in Cornelia. And uh, he, he didn't quite eat all of it. But I told him that grits are really a southern food that you have to know what you're doing. It's not oh, yeah. a throw away. It's, it can be a, a, a hot entire meal. And it depends on your flavor. If you like sweet or you like salty, right. you can put sugar or you can yeah. put salt. <laughs> Now, Dick, you're a, you're a famous author, aren't you? You've, uh, you've um, written a book about the Cayman Islands. Uh, yes. How was, that, how was that? It was good. I, I'm not very fond of the publisher, but uh, no, I've heard he's a, he's a real bastard. Oh, actually. Yes. He's some sort of English. Uh, <laughs> he's a, he's yeah. a red. I met him. He's not very nice. <laughs> he's not nice at all. He's a real pain in the butt. He loses everything he owns at the airport, and. Uh, you can't find him. You can't do business in the U.S. because nobody trusts him. No, they don't. We, he tried to get an account yesterday at a bank in, uh, in Gainesville, and they, they called the police and asked us to leave the, the bank. So uh, we finally managed to find a, a little bank in uh, Clarksville. In Clark, yeah, thanks, Clarksville. I think it's run by the mafia, but we don't care. We don't care <laughs> as long as he gets his... Uh, you know, That's they, right. As long know. as they get their share, they're okay they're with the right. we, they, we can't cross them, you know. We don't want to cross them. We'll we want to keep fingers. them happy. And, uh, <laughs> we'll have to give them most of the profit. <laughs> but other than that, we, we have a, he has an American bank account, and that's a very important thing in his business because he also does poultry. You know, okay. chickens and poultry, and I'm going to take him to the poultry farm down in uh, Cornelia. Just they, be careful, they're, you know, fighting chickens. So well, that's true. <laughs> but he's never, he's probably never seen the fighting chicken ranch. And I'm going to try to find one to show him here. Right down the road. Uh, <laughs> and if we don't want to, we have to be careful not to stay out in the country at night, you yeah. know, in this area. Because we are, we are near an area where people cannot, they're not very friendly to foreigners. And some of them uh, disappear in there and, and never come back. What, what about hippie bikers? How are they with hippie bikers? Well, <laughs> hippie bikers, I've seen some before. And, and they, Heather... They just cruise through, though. They don't, they don't stop. stay. <laughs> it's a, it's a, even the biker gangs are a little afraid to slow down here. Yeah. So yeah, they just keep on that, going. Yeah. And, uh, so for me, I've been here a number of years, and I'm, I'm very uh, happy to still be alive and well. They haven't bothered me, but if I were a foreigner, uh, if I had an accent, for example, if I was a, a, a hate Australian, uh, and some of the Brits have to be careful that they're not taken for Australians. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I can, I can understand that. Yeah, that's a, Mike. <laughs> but, uh, that's about all you need to know to be uh, being American, I guess. Just keep place, to yourself. The place, Play dumb. <laughs> don't don't speak to anybody you don't know. <laughs> keep your head down, wear a hat, and, uh, and just keep on going. I, I lost my hat actually. I? I've lost my hat at Dick's, well, so oh, no. he's, he's got my California Redwoods hat there somewhere. Okay. <laughs> so that was great. <laughs> as far as uh, America, uh, I think we're I think we're probably finished as a country uh, because of uh, certain difficulties that we can't really talk about. For example, our, our food isn't growing right anymore out in the fields. People are massacring our chickens. Uh, you can't go hunting anymore. And uh, 
the supply of grits nationally is, is falling very rapidly. So That's amazing. We're going to have to kill cows and pigs at some point in the future. I really hate when that happens. Uh, <laughs> Maybe a few English people as well. Well, yeah, yeah that's, that's, you know, that's, mm. that's not an if impossibility. The <laughs> <laughs> so now I think you know uh, everything you need to know. And uh, if you want to leave and run back to the airport, we'll try to get well, you there right. safely. Sure glad I came. Uh, Just don't ask directions. Yeah, don't ask directions. <laughs> And don't, above all, this is for Jane, do not get out of any main street, any main highway. Do not take a dirt road into the country. You'll either get mug or shot. Yeah, that's right. Uh, <laughs> or worse. Or worse, yeah. yeah. We'll probably run into a bear or two up here today. And just, when you see a bear, just fall down Play on dead. the ground and, and pretend you're dead. Don't move, don't breathe. No. Sometimes they, they will come by and sniff and, and, and urinate on you. <laughs>